Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Just Pat, and today is Wednesday. Woo! Last video we talked about a concept of am I a nerd and a bunch of other weird things about calling people and asking them about ideas. This video, we're gonna actually use a video idea that my one friend told me about. So, my one friend, his name is Alec. Back from um, my days of working in the, the deli department of a Acme. Yeah, we work together. He's a really cool guy. Picture right now, that's the only one I got of you, I'm sorry. My first year working there was, it was good. Um, that's why I came back for a second year of working. And when I met Alec, it was interesting because he was kind of the guy who was a know-it-all. And to me, it was threatening because I was like, well, crap. I mean, <laughs> what am I supposed to do? This guy seems like to know it all. And I was coming back after my, um, my year of high school. So I was coming back and I kind of forgot a lot of stuff. And he's, he was working there maybe like a month before, a couple months before me. And he really knew what he was doing. He was, he was going at it real hard. I'm like, am I not gonna have a job? Because this guy looks like he just took it. The beginning parts of knowing Alec was pretty hard. But we kind of, I don't know, we started talking about things we were interested in. And he was one of the first people who I really didn't know that well from school. That really transitioned me, transitioned me into the person I am today. Um, so, that being said, like, there's parts of me who are very introverted, but I have that kind of like Alec extrovertedness of knowing why things go the way they go. Uh, I don't know if that makes sense. Sent me a text and he says, talk about, try, could try to talk about what's going on in the world and how it's affecting you. Um, thoughts of the world in your own POV or point of view. He wants to know what I think about the world. And the world seems to be pretty dangerous right now, you know. ISIS, other terrorist groups, Boko Haram. Um, just children slavery, women slavery. Worldwide, like, homeless. Worldwide hunger. Like, what? what is good with the world, right? So, um, I have these. They're called perspective cards. These are a way to start pure spiritual conversations with people. And I have my own set because I like to ask people what they think. Um, so maybe I actually showed some of you who are watching this. Um, and there are a bunch of cards who where it's just pretty much, pretty much how the box says, gaining a perspective of people's faith or beliefs or whatever. So there are um, one, two, three, four, five cards. And I'm only gonna do these for the human nature. I'm not gonna go through them all, because that'd be too weird. There are five cards. One of them is neutral. It says on the bottom, and has a little, like, thing right there, if you can see that, um, is people who are born with no inclination to be good or bad, but do good and bad things depending on their own environment. So that is neutral. Is human life neutral. The next one is we're all perfect. And as you can see, the person is just, there are, is no bad, there's only good. And this is, the description says, people always do what's loving, good, and right. For me, I don't think that's at all true. The next one is broken. So you see that the teeter-totter, te teeter, teeter-totter, <laughs> teeter-totter is broken. And good and bad are just on the ground. And the description says, people were originally created to be pure and good. However, people are not born wanting to be good, but are selfish and do bad things. Broken? They're more good than bad. And the description says, people were born with a strong desire and ability to be selfish and do good things. Uh, and the last one is more good than bad. And that is people who are born with a strong desire and ability to be selfish, self, self, selfish, selfish. People are born with a strong desire and ability to be sh selfish and do bad things. Wait, what was this one? More good than bad. People are born with a strong desire and ability to be selfish, self, selfless. Into 
good things. Which, I don't know if I said. So these are good, more good and bad, more bad than good. So people are born with a strong desire to, and the ability to do selfless things uh, and good things. And this is just, people are born to be selfish. So, so perfect's over there. If you think we're all perfect, I guess you could say we're all perfect. I guess you get out of that like idea that people are perfect no matter what they do. Out of these cards, and if Alec, if you're watching this, what card do you think is your point of view? Like, what do you think human nature is? And so, for the longest time, I thought we were neutral. I thought we were neutral because, for me, I think that anybody can be good, anybody can be good, anybody can be bad, but I feel like we have the chance to be not good or bad. And I feel like many people put the, the stereotype of if you're born into a poor family who is doing bad things, then you too will be bad because you've learned off of the bad things that you learned. Or if you're put into a really rich family that does a marvelous things, then you will be magically good, right? Well, for me, I don't believe that because I've met rich kids who were totally jerks. I'm not going to say another word because that'd be rude. Um, but I've also met really poor people who are so kind and so sweet and so caring. I think I said that. <laughs> but they're so good and they don't care about rich or poor or bad or good, right? I feel like you could be neutral and you could do whatever you want. But, you know what I've been thinking? Sorry, I'm just throwing cards over. I think we're broken. It's kind of like neutral. I just found it. I think it's like neutral, but broken has a different kind of type to it. We can be good. We could be bad. We could be this neutral kind of thing. But, I don't know if I really believe that anymore. Like, we're my life and stuff, and stuff I've dealt with. Stuff I've dealt with. <laughs> I mean, are we good? Are we born to be good? Is that, is that my point of view? I know the point of view that Alec gave me is about this world, but if you can't like figure out like what your stance on human nature is, then how are you gonna figure out what worldwide is? There's some time where I think we're broken because we do, we want to do good things, and I feel like we can, but we don't end up doing them. So that means, like, we're broken inside. Like, I guess I'll go into the religious way of saying it, or a, a religious kind of way. I do believe that I'm a sinner, everybody's a sinner. Like, sinning, like, doing bad things, and you can't really stop yourself from being, um, a sinner. Since I'm a sinner, that means I'm broken. Because I have, I might have the ability to stop sinning, but I choose not to, and I pretty much just slap, slap God in the face, and I just sin, right? What do I think about worldwide? What do I think about um, people of the world? Um, I think people of this world are hungry, not for food. You thought for food? No, not for food. I think they're hungry for love for food, um, for maybe a religious of, they're hungry to be like religious. Um, I think they're hungry to be independent, um, to be safe, uh, to be free, but freedom isn't free. Hungry to be successful, hungry to be, um, to be wanted, to be loved. Uh, I think I said loved already. I think on human life, my opinion is that we're neutral. But as a worldwide view, I think we're broken. So many people are hungry for life. I don't know if that solved your question. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then comment down below, down here, and tell me what you thought. And if you want me to redo this video or make another one, tell me. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day. And 